Diffused deposition modeling involves feeding a thermoplastic filament into a heated extrusion head that moves in the X and Y axes. The heated extrusion head melts and deposits the thermoplastic material on a table that moves in the Z axis, building the model. The molten thermoplastic is channeled through an extrusion tip, which reduces it to a fine bead for deposition onto a substrate material. After depositing each bead, the tip flattens it in preparation for subsequent layers, and the model is built up layer by layer. Layer thickness is typically between five thousandths of an inch to thirteen thousandths of an inch. As it is deposited, the molten thermoplastic material is just slightly above its melting point. Solidification occurs immediately after extrusion, as the material cold welds to previous layers. The most common material used for fused deposition modeling is acrylonitrobutadiene styrene, or ABS thermoplastic, in various colors. ABS provides tensile strengths of up to 5,400 pounds per square inch. Other materials used include investment casting wax, elastomer, polycarbonate, and polyphenyl sulfone. Depending on the machine, maximum part size can range from 8 by 8 by 12 inches on the smallest machine to 24 by 20 by 24 inches on the largest machine. Fused deposition modeling is moderate to fast in building speed. Additionally, most systems incorporate a water-soluble support material, which aids in support removal. The strength and heat resistance of models are also advantageous, and the variety of colors available are useful in accentuating part features.